Having the perfect brows have to be every woman's dream and I'm going to be showing you how to achieve these brows in a detailed video. So the first thing you're going to do is to clean your brows with your wipes and then we're going to go in with our moisturizer. Don't worry, trust the process and we're going to go in with our primer and then we're going to make sure that we know apply this all over our brows and let it soak into our skin skin and then some hair wax we're going to apply a hair wax on it i'm using the regular hair wax if you have the other one that's totally fine then you're going to go in with your spoolie brush up your brow set it in place and then you're going to use your powder puff which is a translucent powder and apply on the brows to keep it dried during this process so the next thing is to draw the brows let us draw our brows so we're going to outline the lower and the upper part of our brows if you watched my other eyebrow tutorials you know that this is the next step so yeah you may when you're outlining the lower and upper part of your brows you're going to like not draw the front part of your brows because that's where our hair like strokes are going to be so at this part i was trying to like determine where my brows was going to stop so i had to use like the end part of my eyes to determine that yeah so i'm going to draw my hair like strokes now and you know that you need a sharpened eye pencil for this so please make sure it's sharpened so you can have those perfect straight lines fill in your brows which i've already done and then we're going to go in with our eyeliner brown gel here i use my wipes and like make sure that my brush is precise and then i went to my eyeliner brown gel you all know that the eyeliner brown gel is to give your brows some pop but applying your moisturizer and primer before your eye pencil gives it more pop initial pop okay okay let's say it gives it the initial pop before this one comes in because you guys are going to see the difference don't worry and tell me if you're going to try this out because the result is going to be different yeah so yeah, we're just going to apply a little bit of eyeliner brown gel everywhere around the brows. And this is my concealer brush for the lower part of my brows. And I'm showing the color of the concealer I'm using for the lower part of my brows. They are two shades lighter than my skin color. And I'm going to use it to, you know, correct any mistakes that I must have done while I was drawing the brows following what I have drawn. Okay, just make sure that you follow whatever you have done drawn but what we're just doing in terms of concealing is to remove any mistakes that we might have done okay so i'm using another brush for the upper part of my brows this is a bit smaller use my wipes to make sure it's precise and i'm using um, a darker concealer for this now i always emphasize in my video that if you just have one concealer and one brush you can achieve this but you have to be very good in blending out your products. Just make sure you have a good blending game. It's going to really help you out. All right. So yeah, we're going to just conceal, use our brush to remove any excess concealer around the brows. I went in with more concealer here because I felt like, you know, the upper part wasn't really giving, but it was still the same shade. So it's darker and it's going to be easy for me to blend out. You're going to see that. I mean, the brows is already turning out amazing. So yeah, I'll use your brush to take out any excess concealer around the brows first and then um, just use it and just take out especially the front part of the brows. Make sure the hair like strokes are on their own. It gives us all the natural things we want in our brows. The hair like strokes, I mean. And then we're going to use our damn beauty blender to take out any excess concealer around the brows. Remember, your, your beauty blender has to be worn, damped, and to clean okay so i went in with more eyeliner brown gel because while i was concealing i messed up a little bit of my you know brows that were the eyeliner brown gel that was there so i'm going to use eyeliner brown gel to make sure that i put the curve back the way it was initially we have to go quietly and slowly because we don't want to conceal this again and the last part is our translucent powder now this is for people who just want to do their brows and go about their daily activities without having to you know do the other part of their makeup so if this is you just apply some translucent powder around the brows lower and upper part of the brows and you are done thank you so much for watching guys if you love this video please don't forget to subscribe give me a thumbs up and also comment if you're going to try out this particular look because it's giving it's giving everything see you in my next one bye